Oh, we're pinned down. What are we gonna do? Hi, old boys. Oh, Maha Beach. Yeah, I did that with this. <laughs> Is that an MG42? God. Oh yeah, yeah, big time, yeah. 1,500 rounds a minute, yeah? Hold the trigger down for a minute, kill 1,500 Allied soldiers. I've done it. Get down! Yeah, they should, shouldn't they? Take cover! You'll die up there! I think I'll be okay. Unless a fellow MG42 gunner from behind opens up. Then I'll certainly take cover. Yeah. And, you know, the Allies might fire back. Hasn't anyone told you? Awkward. Allied guns, they're shit. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure that's quite accurate. Like Allied rifles, then. No, no, it's common knowledge that they're all rubbish. Yeah. Look, I'm not going to jump on the Panzerkampf wagon with everyone else, OK? I think they're actually pretty good. I mean, they've been shooting at us all morning. And you're alive, aren't you? Look, I'll prove it to you. Well, yeah. Look at this, M1 carbine, right? Basically a pellet gun. More use as a club, I reckon. But have a go. I don't know, I mean, seems pretty well made to me. Shoot me with it. Is that a good idea? Go on, just shoot me with it. I'm not going to fire back. You go on, you'll probably miss the accuracy of a German rifle. I, I don't know. Just do it, come on. Yeah, go on. I think you should shoot him. I mean, he's clearly mentally insane. Save the state a job. All right, then. See? Look, it didn't even go through my jacket, did it? Oh. <laughs> well, guys, this has blown my mind. Which is something no actual Allied weapon has been able to do. Yeah. Well, yeah, I, I guess you're right. They are shit. That's what Ick be saying! Come on, guys. Are you sure that, you know, we don't just make very good jackets? It's possible. Ugh! What's that there? This? Oh, it's, uh, it's my Sten gun. Yeah, it's a little trophy I picked up. Well, to be fair, trophies are usually ornamental pieces of inert metal. So, uh, yeah, I guess it counts. Fair play. Well, I actually quite like it. Do you know what? It, it reminds me of a Russian farmer. You know, it's uh, simple, effective, and uh, lightweight. Prove it. All right, yeah. Time to put your money where your testicles uh, were. You know, it's just occurred to me. My brother Hans was killed by an American sniper, allegedly, but it can't have been, not with this stuff. I mean, it must have just been some stray German bullet that killed him. Oh. Right. Oh, need I say more? You know, Allied guns, all a fat load of crup, aren't they? God, this thing's sexy. Wow. Yeah. Oh, what about, uh... The Bren gun, the Bren gun. That's meant to be quite good, isn't it? Or, or maybe that's maybe that's shit too. The Bren? You know what that stands for, don't you? Yeah. Barely rapid. Empty now. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that is shit, yeah. Yeah, I, I knew that. I knew that. What about the uh, M1 Garand, eh? That's pretty uh, good stuff, isn't it? Allied soldiers would give it a thumbs down if they had any thumbs left. Plus, you know, the ping noise. Eh? Yeah, the ping noise. The ping noise, yeah, of course, shit, of course. Oh, God. They must have something good. I mean, the Enfield revolver? Too inoffensive. What about the M2 Browning machine gun? Too extensive. Oh, the M2 flamethrower, eh? Too apprehensive. Oh. What about a Thompson? Too expensive. The Piat. Oh, use your common sense, if... Hello. Sorry to pause the entertainment, but we've got an announcement to make. Yes, we do. We're not getting married. I realise that's what that no, sounds like. We're no, not. no we're, we've got partners and I've got a two-year-old and... He does. No. 
Um, but we're, we're making a website. We are making a website. We yes. are. Just the two of us. Because yes. we thought about reviving our Patreon, as some of you who follow our community posts on YouTube will be aware. Um, and we basically decided that the two of us could probably do a better job. Yes. We'll see. Um, so that's happening. We're very confident. We're very confident. It will be a Patreon-style system. You'll have tiers you can sign up to, and you'll be able to get access to all sorts of behind-the-scenes content, outtakes, vlog posts, blogs about where we got all of our fancy stuff from that we kind of got, some guns and that. Hope no one overheard that. Um, where we film, all that sort of stuff. There'll be giveaways, there'll be quizzes, there'll be, oh, there'll be merchandise for the first time in seven years. Like this. This is an early development model, but it was designed by us, uh, it's manufactured by us, and it's fulfilled by us. So what could go wrong? Every step of the way has got our mark on it, so if it turns up damaged, you know it's because we didn't pack it properly. Ah, brilliant. What's that in there? That's tea. It's that cold. That is no. tea. It's cold. But do you know what it is? It is specialty tea. Ah. Squire branded tea. Yeah. That's right. We're, we're doing our own blend of tea, which yeah. we've specially selected from all, at least three options. <sighs> yes. And you'll be able to buy it soon. We're sourcing it from a very eco-friendly company, which is nice. You know, that's nice, isn't it? People do, that's nice. Yes. It's all biodegradable and eco-friendly and green. Not green tea, it's black tea, but they're green. Not the people. It's good for the planet. It's balance, good for the planet. Balances out planet, his dirty so. car. It's brilliant. Exactly. Fantastic. Uh, and to be honest, we'd quite like to hear what you think about all these things we're doing. Have you got any suggestions? Do you think we're wasting our time? Well, you can yes. let us know. And how you can let us know is on this phone number here. Yes. Now, you might be thinking, one, they don't live in America. You're right, we don't. And two, he's giving out his phone number. Aha. That's a bad idea. No, I'm not. Yeah. Thanks to this week's sponsor. What's this week's sponsor? Well, this week's sponsor's Cloaked. What's Cloaked? Well, I'll tell you what Cloaked is. Thanks for asking, because otherwise I'd have moved on. Have you ever received a spam email or text or call? Oh, yes. I Every you day. Have, have you? Ah. I thought so. Well, what you can do with Cloaked is set up a new phone number and email address by simply creating an account on their app or website. And whenever you sign up to anything where you don't want to give them your real phone number or real email address because you're worried you might get on some junk mailing list or start getting scam calls and stuff like that, you can give them your cloaked number. Every cloaked phone number and email address is a real working number or email, and you can choose whether to have messages routed through to your personal phone number and email. Simply access them in the cloaked app or mute communications altogether. And if you ever get sick of it, if you ever get loads of spam emails coming in, you can just delete it and start a new one. <laughs> I mean, what could be better than that? Literally nothing. Exactly, because th at the end of the day, we really want to hear your feedback about yeah. this website. But once the website's set up, I don't really, you know... Oh, no. I don't want you bothering me in the middle of the night, going, oh, have you thought about doing this? Yeah, Bill. Oh. Bill, I don't think your ideas are very good. Oh, delete. Exactly. Yeah. It's great, and you can get it too, at this link on screen now. Nice. Or in the description. Lovely. Anyway, back to the entertainment. Sorry about that. Yes. Uh, what about their grenades? Yeah, probably shit. No, their grenades are actually pretty good, actually. Uh, ah! No, never mind. No, it turns out our grenades are all pretty similar. Yeah. Oh. They're heavy bombers. They're doing a number on us. I can't stop them, can you? Yeah, all right, fair play. I suppose everything they've got is shit. Uh, I don't mean to worry you guys, but uh, it looks like they're bringing up a tank. Don't worry, we've got Panzerfaust. Bet they haven't got anything like that. They're great. Don't bother wasting it on a Sherman. Ah, I'll deal with it. With uh, your MG42, yeah. Yeah, it's a good plan. Is that, is that wise? Is it tank armor? No, you idiot. <laughs> Wow, an MG84? <laughs> Führer's advocate here. I'm not sure that kind of ammunition expenditure is gonna help our overall situation. Yeah, maybe, I don't know. Ooh, ooh, yeah. All right, I mean, fair enough, never mind. Uh, you are uh, overheating there a little bit, I think. Yeah. Uh. Our guns are just so good, we're waiting for metal to catch up. Yeah, it'll be a while. C 
<laughs> it's worked. All the men have retreated now. Their infantry is hundreds of meters away. Ah, don't worry, my third one's set up for this job. <sighs> now that's what I call good administrative results. I, I, I guess we're, we're basically invincible now, aren't we? Yeah, nothing bad can happen now. We've got such weapon superiority. I think everything's going to be great. You should attack now. Yeah, I can do this. Yeah, I can do this, can't I? Yeah, yeah, I can do this. Yeah. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Hello again. We just remembered we'd like to thank Joe from the Grant World War II Museum over in the Midlands. Ooh! It's a free museum and they've got a bunch of original World War II stuff that you can just go along and handle. Guns, uniforms, all sorts of... Bo bombs, I mean everything. He's got so much stuff. I think you need it if you live in the Midlands. Well, yeah, that's true. Anyway, his website's here. Go and check them out. You need to contact them in advance because they're not open all the time. So if you give them a look on their website and you think, hey, that looks interesting, get in touch with them and book a slot. He's a bloody lovely chap. He was also in this video briefly as the American. Oh yeah, that's why we're thanking him. He was in this video. You remember the guy with this thumb? Yeah, and the... that was him. Thanks, Joe. Thanks, Joe. I don't think he's actually in the army. I don't think I'd salute him. And you're not in the army either. <laughs>